Assalamu alaikum viewers, welcome to my YouTube channel, I am Bilal Academy, I am Bilal and uh, I hope you all will be alright. In this video, I will show you how you can develop an independent algorithm on the Excel for the easy calculation of K value, bubble point and dew point temperatures. And believe me, this video will save a lot of your time. So if you are new at my channel, please subscribe to it and don't forget to ring the bell icon. So without wasting time, let's start. I am on the Excel sheet now and I have taken the binary system. You can take uh, any number of components 2, 3, 4 and 5. Uh, it is up to you and first you have to specify the composition of your mixture and I am here taking the composition of uh, uh, 0.3 for benzene and 0.7 for toluene and then you have to specify the total pressure. Let's suppose it is 100 kPa and uh, for the calculation of k value you have to first calculate the vapor pressure for the calculation of vapor pressure you will use the antoine equation which says the vapor pressure is equal to the exponential of a minus b over t plus c t here the bubble point or dew point temperature and uh, a b and c are the constants which are different for different components and I have taken the values of A, B and C from the book of Chemical Introduction to Chemical Engineering Thermodynamics by Smith. So at the page of 653, the values for the different components have been given. So I have um, specified the two components, uh, benzene and the toluene, which is my system. So for benzene, the A, B and C values are given and the, for the toluene, the A, B and C values are given. So I have taken these values and put in these cells. So let's move to the calculation of bubble point temperature. So for bubble point, you have to just uh, um, first provide the initial value and I am providing here the 100 degree C. You can take any guess. And here uh, I will convert this uh, degree C into the Kelvin by just adding the 273 to this cell and it will give the value of 373. So for bubble point calculation the field is a saturated liquid which is near to its boiling point or the subcool liquid. So uh, for liquid we will specify the composition by the X. So benzene composition is 0.3 and I will specify the cell. And for toluene the composition is 7 and I will use the same column. For vapor pressure we use the Antoine equation. I will uh, put the formula of uh, Antoine equation now. I will use the A value of benzene because I am dealing in the benzene law. B by T plus C. So T here the bubble point which will remain the same so I will fix it and the C. And just put uh, I press the enter and it will give me the vapor pressure of 180 kPa so I will now just drag it down and in this way I can get the vapor pressure of toluene as well so for K value I will divide the vapor pressure by the total pressure which is 100 kPa and I will fix this cell because it will remain same for the toluene as well now I will just drag it down so for y value, I have to multiply the k value with the x. So I will do the same and just drag it down. And for the bubble point, the sigma y should be equal to 1. So let's sum it. So when I will sum this, it will give the value of 1.06, which is greater than the 1. So here I will uh, want the one value. So here I will use a goal sig method. I will go to the data and then the what if analysis and then the goal sig method. And this cell you have to set. I want to set this cell H18. Uh, which value you want in this cell? I want one value. And by changing cell, which cell we have to change? And I want to uh, change this bubble point cell. I will press OK and uh, it will give the value of 1 and here the temperature is to be uh, defined which is a bubble point temperature so our bubble point temperature is 97.96 uh, now you can you have to just 
change the composition and apply the gold sink method and you will get the bubble point and different compositions so for dew uh, point temperature you first have to specify the temperature as you know the dew point temperature is always higher than the bubble point temperature so as a bubble point is 97 i will specify here the 100 uh, which can be the dew point so i will convert it into the kelvin by just adding 273 to the cell and which is 373 and for the dew point calculation the field is a, a uh, superheated vapor or saturated vapor so here the composition will be specified in terms of y so which will for benzene the composition 0.3 and for toluene the composition is 0.7 so for vapor pressure i will use uh, the antoine equation here i will apply the uh, formula a minus b divided by t t will remain same so i will fix it plus c so vapor pressure is 180 i will now just drag it down for toluene and for toluene the vapor pressure is 74 for k value i will divide this vapor pressure by the total pressure which will remain same which is 100 kpa so i will just fix it and now drag it for toluene for x value i have to divide the y by the k and drag it down so for the dew point calculation the sigma x should be equal to 1 so i will set summit so this value is 1.1 which is greater than the 1 we want, we don't want this value uh, we want here the 1 so i will use uh, uh, the goal seek method and i will specify this cell to a value of 1 and by changing the cell of this two point temperature and press the ok and now i will get the sigma x is equal to 1 and it will give the dew point temperature of 1 the 103.49 so over bubble point and dew point temperatures are calculated and now you just have to change the composition value of pressure so you can get uh, uh, easily the bubble point and dew point if you like this video then uh, please subscribe to my channel and press the bell icon so you can get the uh, notification of my upcoming videos and share it with your friends Allah Hafiz.